In this video, I'm going to show how to create a new profile in QGIS. A profile stores information about the plugins that you have installed, the scripts that you're using, etc. Sometimes you have problems, you get strange errors in QGIS that you can't explain and you would like to reset it to a default. Also, profiles are useful to uh, make them for specific projects. You can see then in the square brackets here uh, the name of the profile that you're using. In the settings menu, under user profiles, you see the profiles that you've made. If you want to create a new profile, you go to settings, user profiles, new profile. Make sure that you've saved your project that you're working on because it will create a new instance of QGIS, which will be fresh. And then you can open your project there. Make sure that for your profile name you don't use dots and spaces. That is often causing the problem if you use the default profile. So just give it a short name, call it demo. Then I click OK. And it will start a new instance of QGIS. I can close this window. And here it is, a new fresh QGIS with the name of the profile in the title bar. And you can then still switch to other ones if you want. And if you want to know where the files are stored, you choose Open Active Profile Folder. And there you see where the processing tools and the plugins are stored. 